Your arms are turning to mush. 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 Your skin has to go somewhere. Are you going to get an operation or something? Yeah, I'm going to put it to the floor. <laughs> He's so full of himself. Uh, hey everybody, it's the Jim and Dave's Beer, beer Review. review. Can you please tell us what's on tap for this beer review. Breckenridge Breweries, Mountain Beach, Sour Fruited, 4.5 ABV. Sour Fruited, that's yeah, great. Yeah, it's a bursting aromas of fresh pineapple. This thirst-quenching sour is a vacation in a can. Vibrant flavors of tart, lime, and pineapple blend with the sweet notes of guava to bring the taste of the tropics to the high country. Well, it actually says on the can here, it's bright and tart with pineapple, um, lime, and guava. I just said all that stuff. Not necessarily in that order. But I did say those things. That's good, though. All right. Let's see your glass here, Dave. I think it's about time we need to jump in this. I'm in the mood for a tart sour. I know you are. I'm not. But it's okay. I bought some uh, yeah. Victory. Um, sour Monkey. Well, no, it's actually Fruited Sour Monkey. Fruited Sour Monkey. 9.5% MBB. Well, it has a lot of monkey stuff with nine point something in it. There's a lot of monkey business going on around yeah, a Victory lot of Brewing. Around Victory Brewing for sure, yes. Hmm. Well, that's the clearest beer we've had tonight. Yeah. Woo -hoo. Oh, I'm not a guava fan, to be honest with you up front. Guava. Well, let's just jump right into it, buddy. Did you buy this or did I? I think I did. You did. These are all yours. Cheers. Hmm. That's actually a little peachy. Oh, there's a guava. Lime, sure. Not super prominent. Uh, it's fine. Uh, eh, six out of ten. Not crazy about the aftertaste. It's a little pillowy. A little bit of marshmallowy. Definitely it's all right. Food. I give it a five point seven five. I do like the tart crispness as it goes down. It's very uh, thirst quenching. Oh, look, look at you! You drank all that. I did. I drank all that. All that. Yeah, I drank thirsty. all that and some more. <sighs> There goes that one, two, and one, two, three, four, five, six for you. <laughs> well, I'm trying to lose my right hand. Uh, Cheers. Good. Not fair. See, you know, see what he did? He's cat he's sabotaging things. Sure. Sabotaging. No, no, it's all my fault, Dave. more for you, Dave. It's, it's okay, Dave. More for you. 12 fluid ounces, 4.5%. I don't want you to ADB. die. Okay. Mountain Beach. Bright and tart with pineapple, lime, and guava. Um, yeah, I get all those flavors, too. That's good stuff. It's fun. It's tart. It's not super sour, but, uh, yeah, it's got a nice Christmas story. Yeah, it's a good Christmas story. Crisp. Christmas. Crispy. Christmas story. Let me run a tricorder reading on your hair. Oh, my. Okay, we're good. So, 5.75 out of 10 from Dave. 6 point. 5.75, Zero out of 10 from Jim. Right. And I like that by saying the Surgeon General's warning of the United uh, States, which generally states that well, no, the warning's good. You should always go on things uh, wide-eyed and uh, aware. What's your tail? Women are pregnant. should not drink alcoholic beverages due to the risk of birth effects. Sure. You should not operate heavy machinery or drive a vehicle if you're in the right. influence of alcohol. And of course, excessive drinking can cause health problems. Sure can. And the reason we try all these different beers is we believe that you, our viewers, should drink great beer. Now we're laughing to your friends. Be, Be our friends. friends. Subscribe to our channel. Give us a thumbs up, thumbs down, comment below. And we'll see you next time on the Chip and Day Beer Review. Oh, come back now. Yeah? No. I think that's copyrighted. Mm, it's 1960s. Wasn't that like 60 years ago? Yeah, so it's past no 50 idea. years. Should be fine. Bye-bye.